These are the times snooker players were caught cheating. Number 7. Stephen Lee received a 12-year snooker ban for involvement in multiple match-fixing scandals. In a match against Higgins, he was seen continuously missing easy shots and displaying ignorance, which led to his capture. Stephen Lee, 26. Can you believe that? After all that hard work and far enough. Another chance then. Well, hang on. What's he played there? Six. Complete misjudgment. Well, he's played to go around the black, surely. Well, try and hold the white there on the cushion. Right, just, just push it to the top rail, actually. Oh, hang on. Well, I'm not overly sure about that one. Stephen Lee denied all allegations at that time and claimed he was being unfairly portrayed. If I'd have, I think, I believe that if I'd had a lawyer in there, then uh, there'd be a different outcome completely. So, uh, you know, uh, dirty pictures being painted and uh, the exclusive in the paper for the truth and facts that, um, that I've been through. Well, his ban ends in 2024 on his 50th birthday, and he has shown interest in coming back to the sport. Do you think he should be allowed to compete? Another sad and current situation on number six. The 2015 UK Championship finalist, Leanne Wenbo, who was priorly suspended for his unfriendly gestures after winning a match, got banned for life for fixing five matches and harassing other players to fix matches. Chang Bing Yu, who got a two-year ban, came forward and exposed Liang on a social media platform with proof. He said that Liang strong-armed him to lose the match against Jamie Jones. Apparently, Liang was all in on Jamie and he would have lost everything. Chairman of WPBSA, Jason Ferguson expressed that he isn't happy with young talents going to waste, but no misconduct or cheating of any kind will be tolerated in snooker. Number 5. Rory McLeod and the referee clash over whether it's a free ball. Rory believes he can't reach both sides of the green, while the referee and Gilbert hold a different view. Is that a free ball? It's clear that Rory McLeod is disappointed at Gilbert, possibly suggesting that he believes the referee is not making a fair decision regarding the free ball. He even told Gilbert that he expects more from him. I can't hit the right on this side of that without hitting the black. He's going to hit the black. We're not without hitting the black. I'm going to hit the green first. I hit the green first. I hit the green, no, I won't. I hit the black first. Look. By the time I get full ball here, you can't put that to the side of the head. I don't think it is. I do agree. It's don't not expect to do more. With that. This side I expect more from you, mate. I mean, do you think I'm cheating that? No, I expect more from you, I do. Because if you come and have a look here, you'll see what I'm talking about. No, no, no. Don't. Why don't you want to have a look there? Because I can tell you. For if it was no, this side, you, if, it, if it was this side, you can hit both. You can't hit both sides. I understand. But as I'm this side here. of the green, I'm not here. Yeah, but you said this then what side. What you're saying of the is right from here. What you're saying is right from here. Yeah. I'm over there, mate. Yeah, but you're still on the right side of the green. It doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah, I can't, yeah, I can't yeah. ship the green. I've made the, can we just play the game, please? I know, but I can't. What do you think is happening here? Is McLeod mistaken or the referee is deliberately not giving the free ball? Number four. During the match between Kieran Wilson and Sean O'Sullivan, a peculiar moment occurred when a red ball seemed to move on its own. Do you want to win a cue signed by this snooker legend? To enter, subscribe to our channel, like the video, and drop a comment with which part of this video was your favourite moment. Sean did the right thing and later managed to pot the red. Nine. Well, they definitely moved that time. Happily for 
with Sullivan straight into the hole. At number three, we have an unusual snooker situation. After Gilbert misses a shot, the referee puts the pink ball back, but unexpectedly places the red ball at a different spot, leaving everyone wondering about the implications. <laughs> Foul and a miss. Six. Craig Steadman. Put it back. I'll put the white and then I'll look at red again, okay? Can you have a look, Craig? I'm not too sure. I think the red was like in a line with the pink. Was it not? Yeah, it was a cross. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. That's right, it was Number a cross. Two. Michaela Tab accidentally picks up the wrong ball. She then faces a challenging situation trying to correct her mistake and put the cue ball back in place. Number one, this incident is rather funny and different from the ones we covered before. Dennis Taylor sneaks a red ball onto the table, but the referee quickly spots it and removes it. Dennis then hops on the table and aims to play a shot. We can't say the referee liked it, but one thing is for sure, the audience enjoyed the whole situation. For more snooker videos, click on the video on the screen right now.